and all the others together with them took unto themselves wives, and each chose for himself one, and they began to go unto them, and defile themselves with them, and they taught them charms and enchantments, and the cutting of roots, and made them acquainted with plants, and they became pregnant, and they bore great giants. And they began to sin against birds and beasts and reptiles and fish, and to devour one another's flesh and drink the blood. Then the earth laid accusation against the lawless ones. And Azazel taught men to make swords and knives and shields and breastplates, and made known to them the metals of the earth, and the art of working them, and bracelets and ornaments, and the use of antimony, and the beautifying of eyelids, and all kinds of costly stone, and all coloring tinctures. And there arose much godlessness, and they committed fornication, and they were led astray, and they became corrupt in all their ways. Samyaza taught enchantments and root cuttings, Amaros, the resolving of enchantments, Barakiel taught astrology, Kokabael, the constellations, Ezekiel, the knowledge of the clouds, and Arachiel, the signs of the earth. And then Michael, Uriel, Raphael, and Gabriel looked down from heaven and saw much blood being shed upon the earth and all lawlessness being wrought upon the earth. And they said to the Lord of ages, Lord of lords, God of gods, King of kings, and God of the ages, the throne of thy glory standeth unto all the generations of the ages, and thy name holy and glorious and blessed unto all the ages. Thou seest what Azazel hath done, and hath taught all unrighteousness on earth, and revealed the eternal secrets which were preserved in heaven, which men were striving to learn. And Samyaza, to whom thou hast given authority to bear rule over his associates, and they have gone to the daughters of men upon the earth, and have slept with the women, and have defiled themselves, and revealed to them all kinds of sins. And the women have borne giants, and the whole earth has thereby been filled with blood and unrighteousness. Then the Most High, the Holy and Great One, spoke, and sent Uriel, and said to him, Go to Noah, and tell him in my name, Hide thyself, and reveal to him, The end is approaching and that the whole earth will be destroyed, and a deluge is about to come upon the whole earth, and will destroy all that is on it. And now instruct him that he may escape, and his seed may be preserved for all generations of the world. And again the Lord said to Raphael, Bind Azazel, hand and foot, and cast him into the darkness, and make an opening in the desert, which is in Dudale, and cast him therein and place upon him rough and jagged rocks, and cover him with darkness, and let him abide there forever, and cover his face that he may not see light, and on the day of great judgment he shall be cast into the fire, and heal the earth which the angels have corrupted, and proclaim the healing of the earth, and they may heal the plague, and that all the children of men may not perish through all the secret things that the watchers have disclosed and have taught their sons. And to Gabriel said the Lord, Proceed against the bastards and the reprobates, and against the children of fornication, and destroy the children of the watchers from amongst them, and send them one against the other, that they may destroy each other in battle. For length of days shall they not have, and no request that they make of thee shall be granted unto their fathers on their behalf, for they hope to live an eternal life, and that each one of them will live five hundred years. And the Lord said unto Michael, Go by in Samyaza and his associates, who have united themselves with women, so as to have defiled themselves with them, and all their uncleanliness. And when their sons have slain one another, and they have seen the destruction of their beloved ones, bind them fast for seventy generations, in the valleys of the earth, till the day of their judgment and their consummation. In those days they shall be led off to the abyss of fire, and to the torment, and to the prison in which they shall be confined forever. And whoever so shall be condemned and destroyed will form henceforth, be bound together with them and to the end of all generations, and destroy all the spirits of the reprobate and the children of the watchers, because they have wronged mankind. Destroy all wrong from the face of the earth, and let every weak work come to an end, and let the plant of righteousness and truth appear, and it shall prove a blessing. The works of righteousness and truth shall be planted in truth and joy forevermore. And they took and brought me to a place in which those who were there were like flaming fire, and when they wished, they appeared as men. And I proceeded and saw a great place which burns day and night, where there are seven mountains of magnificent stones, one of pearl and one of jason, and those towards the south of red stone. But the middle one reached to heaven like the throne of God of alabaster, and the summit of the throne was of sapphire, and I saw a flaming fire. 
and I saw the deep abyss with columns of heavenly fire, and among them I saw columns of fire fall, and beyond that abyss I saw a place which had no firmament of the heaven above, and no firmly founded earth beneath it. There was no water upon it, and no birds, but it was a waste and a horrible place. I saw there seven stars like great burning mountains, and to me, when I inquired regarding them, the angel said, This place is the end of heaven and earth. This has become a prison for the stars and the host of heaven, and the stars which roll over the fire are they which have transgressed the commandment of the Lord in the beginning of their rising, because they did not come forth at their appointed times. And Uriel said to me, Here shall they stand, the angels who have connected themselves with women, and their spirits assuming many different forms are defiling mankind, and shall lead them astray into sacrificing to demons as gods. Here shall they stand till the day of great judgment, in which they shall be judged till they are made of an end. And the women also of the angels, who went astray, shall become sirens. And I, Enoch, alone saw the vision, the ends of all things, and no man shall see as I have seen. And these are the names of the holy angels who watch. Uriel, one of the holy angels who was over the world and over Tartarus. Raphael, one of the holy angels who was over the spirits of men. Raguel, one of the holy angels who takes vengeance on the world of the luminaries. Michael, one of the holy angels to wit, he that is set over the best part of mankind and over chaos. Serachiel, one of the holy angels who was set over the spirits who sin in the spirit. Gabriel, one of the holy angels who was over paradise and the serpents and the cherubim. Remuel, one of the holy angels whom God set over those who rise. From thence I went to another place to the west and the ends of the earth, and I saw a burning fire which ran without resting. I asked, saying, What is this which rests not? Then Raguel, one of the holy angels who was with me, answered me, and said unto me, This course of fire which thou hast seen is the fire in which the west persecutes all the luminaries of heaven. And I went from thence to the middle of the earth, and I saw a blessed place in which there were trees, with branches abiding and blooming, and between them a deep and narrow ravine. And all the ravines were deep and narrow, of hard rock, and trees were not planted upon them. Then said I, For what object is this blessed land, which is entirely filled with trees, and this accursed valley between? Then Uriel answered and said, This accursed valley is for those who are cursed forever. Here shall all the accursed be gathered together who utter with their lips against the Lord unseemly words, and of his glory speak hard things. Here shall they be gathered together, and here shall be the place of their judgment. In the last days there shall be upon them the spectacle of righteous judgment in the presence of righteous forever. And from thence I went to the south, to the ends of the earth, and saw there three open portals of the heaven, and hence there came dew, rain, and wind, and from thence I went to the east, to the ends of the heaven, and saw here the three eastern portals of heaven, open and small portals above them. Through each of these small portals pass the stars of heaven, and run their course to the west on the path which is shown to them. And I looked and turned to another part of the earth, and saw there a deep valley with burning fire. And I asked the angel of peace who went with me, saying, For whom are these chains being prepared? And he had said unto me, These are being prepared for the hosts of Azazel, so that they may take them and cast them into the abyss of complete condemnation. And Michael, and Gabriel, and Raphael, and Phanuel shall take hold of them on that great day, and cast them on the day into the burning furnace, and the Lord of spirits may take vengeance on them for their unrighteousness in becoming subject to Satan, and leading astray those who dwell on the earth. And in those days shall punishment come from the Lord of spirits, and he will open all the chambers of waters which are above the heavens, 
and of the fountains which are beneath the earth, and all the waters shall be joined with the waters, that which is above the end, and the waters which is beneath, and they shall be destroyed, all who dwell on the earth, and those who dwell under the ends of the heaven. And when they have recognized their unrighteousness, which they have wrought on the earth, then by these shall they perish. Then God blessed Noah and his sons, saying to them, Be fruitful, and increase in number, and fill the earth. I now establish my covenant with you, and with your descendants after you, and with every living creature that was with you, the birds, the livestock, and all the wild animals, all those that came out of the ark with you, every living creature on earth. I establish my covenant with you. Never again will all life be destroyed by the waters of a flood. Matinda wound the ehue and the earth cost it. Haye Laite and I shall abal him, Beatty.